me and you We're here till the road again now Just me and you We go along We'll make it perfect, perfect I remember when times were better But sometimes you have to do whatever it takes To get those times back No! Summoning spirits of the dead is a bad idea. Bad idea. I don't see we got no choices. Since we lost Crothers, we be more confuddled about finding our treasure than ever. Don't you can, Shidokin. No, I don't care, Tom. I don't want nothing to do with summoning up spirits of the damned, even if my own good buddies they be. Oh, my skin is itching. Oh, I'm so uncomfortable. Oh, oh. So, you think I am wanting to have a seance, do you? That it's my favorite thing to sit, holding hands with you buggers, summoning the spirits of the dead, inviting Lucifer into me ship with a hearty hidey hello. Hidey hearty. Oh, I'm so itchy with the fear. Hold fast, Mulligan, for questions we have and answers we need, so the time has come it has to summon up the spirit of old Crothers. Oh, I don't like this. I am talking now to the spirit world, that world filled with souls and demons and black-hearted oozing buggers what make decent living type folk puke up at the sight of ye. Oozing buggers! We is trying to get a hold of Crothers, who is a dead type feller of the recent variety, so he won't look as disgust a Peyton as the rest of ye. Tom, Tom, I is afraid that Crothers is gonna blame me for his dying. Yeah, it's your not does she? No, I ain't being silly. All I was saying before he got shot in his head was, I want to shoot the ghost. The ghost shooter, that's me. And then he got shot, and then he was the ghost. Mm. Oh, I can almost hear the spook calling out for me now. Mulligan. Mulligan. Mulligan! Pipe down, you lovers! I is trying to talk to Satan! Enough! What are we supposed to do with a pitcher that says 250 feet? 250 ghost feet? The ghost of Crothers has 249 extra legs, guys! Oh, I can almost hear that dreadful tiptoeing. You'll be civil to the ghost of Crothers, even if when he appears his face is falling off and Satan has turned his arms into spiders! No! That's enough! I'm done! If we keep bothering this Santa guy, one of us is gonna get possessed! And I am happy just being me, thank you very much. And I like you just being Tom, Tom. And you stay only the cat and cat and. And you. You! Spiritus Amicus. Hello, Mulligan. Oh! Arr, success! The spirit of Crothers be pouring out of that bird like smoke and oakum. Oh, it's you on the dushy. I'm fine, Tom. Thanks for asking. Yeah, not that I've scored all that bad. Except for the fire and the pitchfork jams. <laughs> Did the spirits tell you anything about our treasure? Did you learn anything, being dead and all? Aye. I was told where our treasure be. You were, were you? But I did not hear all of it on accounts of all my having beer and pudding at the time. Oh, it's emotional. 
Yes, Tom. All the pudding you can eat. So, the devil told you where our treasure be. But you missed it. Being too drunk and full of sweets. No, I remember some. Look for the flying birdie and follow his path. And start from the ship. That's important too. Over oh, away from his nest. A birdie. <gasps> and now I is a bird. That's irony, that is. Mm. Well, it's hard to concentrate when you're sitting on a beer volcano. That's it. A flying birdie be the great secret of the afterlife. No, Captain. There be more. It's looking at me, Captain. And it be in regards to... Sweet Mother of Mercy. In regards to Mulligan. Oh, no. I will not be murderized by a bird and a phantom and my very good friend at the same time. Just, uh, give me a head start before you come to eat my brains and guts and soul. I were only going to say we should have been listening to him from the very beginning. Mm. Aye, Tom. There may be truth to your words. How do we know that bird be channeling crothers and not some devil weaving sugary lies? This parrot, whose body I'm least in the speaking. I need proof, you be crothers, not loose of her in a bird suit. Uh, then ask me something only me and you knows, Captain. You being Captain and me being crothers. I'll ask you a question then. Me greatest secret I only shared with one man. That man being crothers. What happened to Tutty? in the treasure chest, Captain. You put him there to keep him safe. Oh! <laughs> they made it! They made it! To the safety of the beautiful crow's nest! <laughs> yes! Yes! Floating voice of what turned out to be me best mate were hit in the face by lightning. Call me Homeyomeo! <laughs> I have not gone back to hell. Oh, Nariori Shinto san. No, Tom, I am not happy. I can tell I'm stuck in this parrot, and all of his luck were bad. How can I be your mate, looking like this? <sighs> Where is he going? Don't know.
look like a pirate to me. Now you can fly behind merchants and stab them unawares. And your smallness will help you get drunk faster. <laughs> Captain, is this crying some sort of a code type thingy? No, other spirit. I am crying on a couch I am overcome with emotions. Your midgety bird body has taught me that Tutty were the treasure I were truly missing. And in a way, it turns out the treasure was with us the whole <laughs> I'm okay. Where am I? Will someone check and see if there's wood sticking out of me head? I am disgustipated with the lot of you. Don't they die? Don't they get die? Oh! <laughs> 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 <laughs>